I'll be here. I thought you were taking me home. Do you want to go home? I'll take you home. No, that's all right. I just wondered. What were you singing? I wasn't singing. Well, no, you just didn't think I could hear you over the engine, but I could. You don't cry at weddings, but you sing at funerals. You told me you weren't an interesting person. I'm not. Come on, what were you singing? I don't sing for people. It's private. Oh. Well, hum a few bars. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what song is that? Mm -hmm. Boy, I uh, mm -hmm. still have no idea. It's a Beatles song, come on, guess. Mm -hmm. Oh, I hate to break this to you, but that, that tune has no resemblance to any song the Beatles ever recorded. It's a long and winding road. Mm -hmm. Oh, no that, no, that goes more like... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> You're worse than I am. Are you gonna push me out? I thought you'd trust me. Here, hold on to my shoulders. You ready? Push, push again. Oh! Isn't that exciting? Huh? I can't stop! <laughs> Come here. Ta-da! My boat. Oh, it's great. Yeah. I mean, it could be great. She could be great. You always refer to a boat as a female. Why? Well, I guess if you're some sweaty sailor out at sea for a year, you need to use your imagination. What are you going to do with she? <laughs> I'm going to fix her up, and I'm going to sail off into the sunset. You have a rich fantasy life, don't you? Uh-huh. Don't you? Don't you have fantasies? I do. Yeah? I do. But they're private. Don't tell them to anybody. Not even a dance teacher? Mm, you're not just a dance teacher. I can't figure it out what you are. Hey, isn't that what everybody wants? A smooth sailing life? Well, you can achieve that for a minute out on a dance floor or the water. Oh, look how lovely. Mm. That one would look great on you. Oh, well, Tom hates me in hats. Then I'll buy it for you. <laughs> no. But the look on Tom's face. We'll take that one right there. Oh. What does your wife hate you to wear? Boxer shorts. She doesn't think they're sexy. Oh, I think they're very sexy. <laughs> We're gonna be bad. We're gonna be so bad. Hey, I got him. He's gonna buy 325 loaded, chrome wheels, tinted glass, alarm, phone, wool carpets, two more beamers, and I. I win your trip to Vegas. Mm. I don't even like the color. I mean, it just... Look, just sit. Just sit. Just sit. I don't like it. See there? Mm -hmm. Want to go out further that way? Yeah. That's good. You're really doing that well. That's really good. I need to Do talk you... to you. Uh, I'm with the customer. But if you're interested in a makeover, you'll have to wait your turn. Now, I want you to try the dusty rose. This is important. So is my career. Line, right there. Tish. I'm with a customer. Now that, that works. Yeah? Yeah. That definitely works. Your husband is having an affair with my wife. You are insane. If I had any idea how insane you were, I would never have let you start up with me. <laughs> what? You seduced me. <laughs> I'm sorry. Uh, I'll be right back. Take your time, honey. <laughs> uh, your opinion of Larry is a tribute to your insensitivity to other human beings. Larry 
would never have sex with someone like your wife. I'm not worried about sex. I'm worried about them having a relationship. Uh, You've ruined my life. <laughs> and you are jeopardizing my new job here as assistant manager of this department. So, if you like a private consultation, please call for an appointment. And if you ever come here and upset me again, I will have the security guards throw you out of the store. Now, where were we? Uh, making the lips fuller? Yes. <laughs> so I burn her underwear. So what? I'll buy her more. I mean, can you... He's sick. He's a beast. I mean, how am I supposed to go anywhere looking like this? Well, in some countries, bald is considered attractive. And I didn't marry you for your looks anyway. I want a divorce. Yeah. Ruin that low-life appliance salesman. I'm getting that done. He's not a low-life appliance excuse salesman. Me, excuse me, I'm sorry, folks, but we're very late. Sorry. I had no idea your job was so dangerous. Where are we running? How about lunch? I'm not hungry. Good. <laughs> Fish must be so happy. They must be. They have mating rituals like Italian operas. <laughs> I hate to leave this with such a great idea. Let's call in sick. <laughs> Maggie can take my glasses. I can't call in sick. And then call in well. <laughs> Tell your boss it's too beautiful for you to take notes on other people's problems. Come on, I'll call for you. You want me to? No, I call for myself. If the lake were to swallow me up right now, I would die a happy man. It has been a long time since I've been this happy, too. Is it just me, or do you also have this uncontrollable desire to put our lips together? We can't. You're right. We can't. Why can't we? Have you ever cheated on Tish? Once. Hmm. In Monopoly. I stole all her good properties while she was doing her nails. <laughs> How about you? A Catholic schoolgirl? Yeah. No. So what would happen to us? Well, we could be lovers. Or we could be friends. We are friends. If we're lovers, we have to lie. I don't think I can do that. Yeah, me either. Okay, we make love once and then never see each other again. Mm. Mm. <laughs> friends, then. Very special friends. Well, Tom and Tish would be insane with jealousy. So what? Who cares? We're going to be innocent. We'll be this great couple. Years from now, we'll be in the Guinness Book of Records. 20 years, people will say, and they never had sex. You're kidding me. No, it's true. And all those years, I'll be dreaming of kissing you. We don't go without. Not just one. Friends, remember. What do you do on the weekend? I spend as much time as I can with Chloe. Tom loves to go to a restaurant he cannot afford, and then complains all through dinner. 